Kemring Group is a global business providing a range of advanced technology products and services to the aerospace, defense and security markets. Kemring has extensive operations in the Americas, Europe, Middle East and Asia. It is headquartered in Romsey and is listed on the London Stock Exchange. Topic history The business was formed in 1905 as the British, Foreign and Colonial Automatic Light Controlling Company Limited to make timers for gas street lighting. In the 1950s the company diversified into silver-coated filaments for lighting. It was subsequently established that such filaments had an alternative use as chaff for radar decoy purposes. The company was first listed on the London Stock Exchange in 1974. The Falklands War led to Kemring opening a new factory to produce aluminium glass chaff decoys in order to counteract the threat of sea skimming missiles. In 1986, Kemring acquired pyrotechnics specialist Payne's Wessex and moved into IR decoys. The first Gulf War led to a rapid increase in Kemring's production of countermeasures in support of the U.S. led coalition. In 1992, the company acquired its main competitor, Haley and Weller. This resulted in Kemring supplying the majority of the UK Ministry of Defence's countermeasure and military pyrotechnic needs. In 1993 Kemring established a presence in the United States with its first U.S. acquisition, Alloy Surfaces Company Inc. This was furthered in 2001 when Kemring acquired Kilgore Flares Company LLC, making the group the largest provider of decoys to the United States Department of Defense. In 2006, the Kemring Group acquired pool based BDL systems for £9 million. In 2007, the company acquired Simul Difesa, an ammunition supply business, as well as Richmond Electronics and Engineering, a business specializing in bomb disposal technology. In 2008, it went on to buy Scott, a business making devices for aircraft emergency systems, and Martin Electronics, a manufacturer of ammunition and fuses. In 2009, Kemring acquired High Shear Technology Corporation, a U.S. leading manufacturer of high reliability energetic solutions that perform critical functions in key U.S. space and defense programs. In 2010, it purchased Roke Manor Research, a center for advanced technology research and development based in Hampshire, UK, from Siemens for £55 million. In 2011, the company acquired the detection systems operations and certain related assets of General Dynamics Armament and Technical Products, a subsidiary of General Dynamics Corporation. The business operates as Kemring Detection Systems Inc. and is a U.S. leader in chemical and biological threat detection and has advanced capability in standoff detection of improvised explosive devices. In 2012, Kemring disposed of its marine interests, Kemring Marine, to Drew Marine. Topic operations Kemring Group operates in four market sectors, countermeasures, protecting aircraft, ships and land platforms against guided missile threats sensors and electronics, equipment to detect and disable concealed IEDs improvised explosive devices, unexploded ordnance, electronic warfare and chemical and biological threats pyrotechnics and munitions, products for use in Navy, Army and Air Force applications energetic systems, propellant, explosives, missile and ammunition components, thrusters, initiators and other components for the space sector. Topic. Controversy In 2002, a report on the BBC Today programme claimed that a salesman from PW Defence, a Kemring subsidiary, had agreed to sell landmines to an undercover reporter. The anti-personnel weapons were outlawed in the UK in 1998, following the signing of the Ottawa Treaty. In 2011, it was revealed that CS gas produced by Kemring was used against civilian pro-democracy protesters in the 2011 Egyptian Revolution. Later in 2014, it was also revealed that tear gas used against demonstrators in the 2014 Hong Kong protests was provided by Kemring. In 2018, it was announced that the Serious Fraud Office had opened an investigation into corruption and money laundering by Kemring following a report from Kemring's subsidiary, Kemring Technology Solutions, CTSL, which is also being investigated. The inquiry will look at the conduct of business by Kemring Group and CTSL.